because we're going to our first stay away of the 2023 season. And because a few of you have asked me what I would need to go to a stay away show, I thought I'd show you what I've packed. In the back of the lorry, we've got our silver more haylage, our hay, our shavings for their bed, and then we've got our wheelbarrow, and here are our poop picking stuff, and then we've got our brush, and then we've got our water buckets. So that's what the ponies have, and now let's go and show you what we've got. So inside our tuck locker, we haven't quite finished all of it, but I'm going to show you what we've got in it so far. So inside our tuck locker, we have our equilibrium massage pad. We have our bridal sands been cleared and been put in our bridal hangers bridal bags and then we have um, our stuff that we can clean our tack with but we have our first aid kit which hopefully we won't need and then we've got our grooming bag with our tendon boots in them and we've got our sour well treats and our supreme stuff which is also a grooming bag so we have stuff like coat gloss in it to make them all shiny and then we have these which are lead ropes for holding outside the ring and then to treat our ponies we're going to put these in our their stables which hopefully they'll love and then we've got our saddles they're not all in yet so I'm going to ride and then we'll put them in after I've ridden and then we've got our girths behind there and my whips down here and then we in this huge bag we've got all my show rugs and my clean saddle pads so they've all been washed and they'll all now be ready for the show so in here we have our freezer that is very important because it has all our food in it and then we've got my jelly jumps which I love to play with my friends with and then here we have a table and chairs which we probably won't use because it's winter but we would usually put, take them to the summer shows so we could sit outside so we have our trolley at the back there which we can take the stuff from the lorry to the stables so in here we have our brand new stable guards which I'm really excited to, to use because it has my new logo on it and then we have my new chair which we can put by the stable so in between my runs I can have a rest and then this is Marbles is metal pen so when me and my friends are playing we can also play with him too and we have his dog food here and that's my dog there and that's what we have in here the night or the day before we go to a show I always do flat work and this time they were really good both of them Have a mini and I've done some flat work and I've just packed my crafty ponies in the bed. This one's Fly. He was my elf tenion because he looks like her. I named it Fly. And then this one's Casper. And he's 
got my spotty rug on him. And then this one's GM. He's white. They all keep falling over. <laughs> and this one's Robbie. And he's got a team stock Gale rug on him that I got in a set. Which I also have a tail bandage for that I only put on him. And then I have this black one which is Harry and he's super black which I love to snuggling them on so these are all my crafty ponies that I've packed ready to go Oh, we have 
have to make their beds and put hay and water in. I just arrived at Sappy last night and I did two clear rounds on rubber and now it's the morning and I'm walking in the course for the grey and heat and I'm doing it on Minnie and Jem. We haven't had Jim very long and I'm still getting used to him. There's a few things we need to work on but I was really pleased with how he went. She's the best pony ever. I still just can't believe it because I qualified the hicks there in the winter of the night. Show days are really busy. I did eight rounds both days, Saturday and Sunday, which means we don't get very much time for filming, so these clips are a mixture of both days together.
last walk was at quarter past seven and this time I walked it with Rappi, Raffi and my trainer Paul Kelly. Jim was really good in the winters. He just had four faults, but it was really unlucky, and it was the most hardest and technical course I've ever ridden. to come forth in the winters on gym. Well done to everybody who competed at South View. You all did amazing. We got three equal fast for jumping clear in the under 11. I think he wants attention because I've been riding. No, I do not have any tweets. No, I don't. I do not have any tweets. I'm just playing with my friends Ava and Neely <laughs> and we're playing jelly jumps. Yay! I'm putting it bigger. <laughs> I know you can do it. Alright, just leave it here again. Leave it a bit in the car. Look at the size of She won. We were so delighted and surprised. She's the best girl ever. Are we competing at the Royal International Horse Show at Hickstead on the 26th of July? Hope you enjoyed seeing what I unpacked for a stay away show. We had a great weekend at and Daddy's made me a Sunday roast at 9 o'clock at night. Thank you Daddy for kicking. <laughs> Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel for more pony adventures.